You have to be aware, when you're in your home, sometimes the air inside your home can be more toxic than the air outside, which is why we're dedicating a whole segment to trying to get you to breathe a little bit more easy. Exactly. Um, and purify that air inside. Exactly, because you know what? If I offered you two glasses of water, oh. which one would you pick? I want the gray one, please. Right? No, obviously, I'm going to go with the clear. Right, so then why would you breathe in dirty air by choice? And yeah. that's what a lot of us do because we just don't know that's right. what we're actually breathing in. Okay. So I think part of it is being aware. Mm -hmm. And speaking of which, there's actually an amazing company called Aware, but A-W-A-I-R, air at oh, the end. Nice. And they've created, they're very chic and These beautiful. Great. So they're great to introduce into your home. This is a little plug-in. The, the man that created this, created it for, designed it for his daughter who, suffered from eczema, very mm -hmm. severe eczema, and thought there must be a better way to figure out what's going on in our environment. Right. So he created this product, and what this does is it will actually test the chemicals and the allergens within your space mm -hmm. and send a reading to your phone of your current Ooh, air health. Nice. And not only that, it will give you recommendations on how to fix the problem. That's incredible. Absolutely. So like this, the, what a be, time to be alive, right? Right. All the technology that we have now. So I think this is just incredible because you don't really know what to do unless you know what you're dealing with. That's true. And the reality is, as you mentioned, we spend 90% of our time inside. Mm -hmm. And the irony to that is, the inside environment is actually five times more polluted than outside. It and what is. happens when we have seasonal allergies, we curl up inside. And mm -hmm. sometimes that's where the worst allergens are actually affecting us. Absolutely. So dealing with purifying the air, tip number one, mm -hmm. and this is a super, I'm like a genius. Yeah. Open the windows of your house. <laughs> <laughs> even in Flush the even in the dead the of winter, if even if you're Honestly, experiencing cold temperatures, you gotta open them up. Ten minutes is Ten all minutes. you need. And if you oh, have good. a back and front door or side to side, create that cross flow and ventilation uh. to get the air whipping around. Turn off your heat so you're yes. not losing the heat and helping the environment and the energy savings there. Yeah. But just flush your home for 10 minutes a day. Okay. And what that can do is amazing in terms of um, increasing the productivity of, of your air quality. Certain people in certain cultures keep the windows open all winter long. I right. used to know certain teachers when I was growing up. Yes. They always had the classroom window open in, in order to stimulate learning. Absolutely. Because you needed that new air Absolutely. constantly circulating. And speaking of which, house plants. Yes. And some are better than others. And in fact, I was just at my local grocery store and what do you know, this one came, the curly, um, the crispy wave, came with the little tag on it, calling it out as an air purifying plant. Got it. So being able to put that by your bed, mm -hmm. in the kitchen, it will actually circulate, aloe vera will circulate the odors, the allergens in the air and help to purify your space. So this I is like... I didn't realize this was one of them. That's yes. cool. Al well, aloe, aloe vera, vera has so many great, um, great properties to it, mm -hmm. but that is an additional one. Amazing. A fantastic one. And then it looks great too. And people that yes. say, well, I don't have a green thumb. Well, Fix it. <laughs> <laughs> That's Don't you want to breathe these? That's me. <laughs> yeah, get a few of these and put them strategically around. Put you them know, where you're going to together. see them often. That's yes. the key. This isn't about design of mm. putting them because really a house if it only looks good and it's not breathing well and feels good, then yeah. it's no good. Right. So put these where you're gonna see them. That's why I love the idea of like right beside the your bed, nightstand. Good Because then you can like put, if I take a glass of water to bed at night. Yes, me too. Do a little extra in there and yeah. then it stays all happy. Right. It stays happy. Especially if you have pets, by the way. Yes, You absolutely. really wanna make sure that air is clear. Absolutely. So then we go to something a little bit more technologically based for mm -hmm. purifying. And this is a HEPA filter. Yes. And everything I'm gonna show you is from Home Depot. And this one in particular is great because it's a really nice small size, but it has a replaceable filter that okay. every four months you're going to replace it and it will take out over 99% of allergens from the air. Wow. So again, at night we spend so much time in our beds and that's where a lot of dust and dander can, mm -hmm. you know, it's all the textiles and stuff in the space. Yeah. You want to have this working all the time and actually helps to remove odors as well, Good. which is great. Air, uh, furnace filters. Yes. I think so many times we forget the importance of these to change them, and this one actually is a reusable one. So for cost savings purposes, invest a little bit more, but you'll save a ton in the long run. Uh -huh. That we take this out every two to three months, put it in the bathtub, spray it down, mm -hmm. and then it can go back in clean. And the stuff you see coming it's off. It's nasty. Oh my gosh, you want to then go buy more plants, more air filters, yeah. like all the things. It's gross. Exactly. And one of the bigger things that I think so many people, it's, it's one thing to be able to have your air an issue, mm -hmm. but it's what you don't see that's causing it. And a lot mm -hmm. of times that's mold. 
and oh, mold. Right. Nobody wants to talk about mold. No. Nobody wants to admit they have mold. No, because they have to. You have to tear your whole house down. Well, you don't. That's annoying. <laughs> you don't. There's a couple amazing products. I think first of all is identifying where the mold is, and mold happens through humidity. Yeah. So I think this time of year too, the air is so dry. So many people invest in humidifiers. Yeah. You're adding more moisture into the air, and that becomes a little cesspool for all kinds of things growing and partying oh, in your right. house. Yeah. Bathrooms, basements mm -hmm. are big areas we need to be cautious. This little guy. Mm-hmm. Two dollars and fifty cents. Yeah. It will tell you the humidity in your space. Stick okay. this in your basement and look at it often. And there's a little range for what's recommended. The least expensive investment to let you know if there's a problem happening in your basement, and know. then you deal with it. If you are really concerned, because sometimes the problem is behind the walls mm -hmm. and we can't see, this little guy actually plugs into your phone and it's a moisture meter. And you can go around and read, you hold this right up to all your drywall mm -hmm. and it will read the moisture content. So if this starts flickering, if, if this is telling you that you're outside of the normal range, mm -hmm. you might have a problem behind the wall, then we need to investigate. Oh boy. Very important. Okay. And in bathrooms, often people have the fans mm -hmm. to help get rid of humidity. This little guy, Amazing. This is an automatic humidity sensor that will turn the fan on automatically when there's humidity oh, yeah. and shut it off when it's been dealt with. Nice. So that you don't have to think or worry. And then okay. if you do have mold issues, mm -hmm. cleaning it is so important, but we have to be careful with that. So there are amazing products like Moldex product mm -hmm. actually will not only clean the surface, mm -hmm. but inhibit mold from growing in the future. You pour things, take amazing. a drink of water. Thank you. It's not, it's not the bad air for no, her. She's, the she's air battling every, every, everything that everyone else is battling right now. This is really key information and I love that. So not only are you clearing the air in your life, uh, you're also cleaning up the nutrition in your life. You That's and me. I and so many of the City Line experts and so many of City Line viewers are on this same journey. So I'm really excited uh, about this year's City Line Weight Loss Challenge. It is just bigger and better than ever. And everyone can join and follow along. Everything you need is online. It's at CityLine.tv. So I'm talking about recipes. We have new meal plans. Dr. Joey has best tips for success, which we need those little reminders all along the way of your weight loss journey. So continue to join us with that.